Paula, dude. Why upsetty? Get some spaghetti. <laughs> when I think of Italian tanks, this is the first thing that comes to mind. This tank destroyer, when you say Italian ground forces, Italian tanks, this is it. Not, not this. Can, can you just, this is real life, guys. This really happened. This has been in the game for, I don't know, a month. I don't, uh, with how fast you can play this thing. The days go by like minutes. But this was the cream of the crop, pretty much, for the Italian ground forces in World War II on a se semi-mass-produced scale. And it looked good for the time. That's really good. That's really good for 3.3. I mean, the whole angling of the vehicle is fantastic from the front. Well, just, just bear, bear with me. 105, 105, 102, 60, 60. And then they kind of throw it away with this very low slopage armor here. I mean, I guess maybe that was, you know, well... When someone adds rivets to a tank, I don't really expect them to really know what they're doing. But at the same time, hindsight is twenty twenty. I mean, for g good Lord, someone give me an amen for this. This was the first Ferrari. Look at this Ferrari. 35 kilometers an hour top speed, 170 horsepower in World War II. I'll tell you right now, this thing would beat an Enzo. What would happen is that this thing would start, it might go about 10 meters, and it would shoot the Enzo in the ass. If you guys haven't seen this, this thing has a big old gun, 105 millimeter at 3.3 that doesn't have that much penetration. Yeah, so this is the predicament with the GC Leoncello, is that we have a big gun, small, you know, stubby gun, a lot of armor, but to get this gun to really work at 3.3, we're going to have to get close. But that's not accounting for the heat. The heat's what makes this vehicle, I think. This is going to be a first impressions game today. But 120 millimeters of pen at 3.3. That's enough to go through anything. So I think the plan is we're going to take majority of this effort Efito, Pronto, Mod 43, and then we'll back it up with the Granada Performanate. Da, <laughs> 105. Oh, man, I love language. It is just marvelous. Da, this is, guys, this is a Russian spy. Okay. <gasps> oh, I totally forgot about that. Comments below, we'll play that next, I promise. Or just don't comment below, and we'll still play it next. See, win win. Uh, but welcome to the first match. For the first battle, we're taking full ammo just to get a feel of how boomy this thing is, how, how fast this thing can explode and will explode. And also just to see what round we're going to use the most so I can load it up like that for the next game. 3.3 to 3.7. You know what this, this cap shell would obliterate? A Sherman. Just, oh, just notch right into that armor. Hey, speaking of an American tank. Oh, come on. You got to. Oh, wow. That was a really weird bouncy. Second shots almost on the way. Can we get a better RNG roll? No, none right there. Whoa, that turned my tank. Oh, okay. We're firing like this. I see why. Maybe that pushed our second shot off. Okay, we're whittling them down one by one. Ah! Nice. Okay, good explosive mass. And... Whoa, a Chinu. Oh! That's just devastating. Okay, we're gonna push up and take a right here. Get into some cover. That Chinu does have the advantage and does have the better gun. 
to use on me. Oh, wow. But that kill feed, though. Beautiful. One thing I do like about these Italian tanks is how slow it allows you to play. Oh, I haven't even checked this thing's depression. 10. Average. Nice. <laughs> oh, come on. It, that goes through there. It should go through there, right? Capola, dude. <laughs> okay, this shell's working out. That fat Capola. Okay, I'm feeling confident, but I'm probably gonna die if I pull out here. No, okay, looking good. Hey, you should not be over here. Not right into that armor. There's the Japanese tank. Can I get a? I can't, I don't know. I don't know. It's kind of iffy. I can, I can't make him out, but I'm going to shoot. Okay, nice. He's dead. All I have to do is look at the enemies. Oh man, this thing has got explosive mass for 3.3. Oh, here we go. 275. Is this where they're going to be pushing out from now on? We'll just hold here. Hey, sun over. Uh oh. Hex. Nothing. A tree is down though. That's the, that's important. Okay, I'm gonna push out. See if we can get maybe shot one time and maybe potential bounce it. Don't want to be over there with artillery with a, you know, <laughs> a quick ass. Watch this, though. Oh, you son of a gun. And, and I pushed myself over to the um, right a little bit. Okay, hang on. I have a plan here. I'm going to push myself back over to the left or the right. Then now I can shoot again. Yeah, perfect. Oh, come on. We're about to have some fun. Attention to the map. He penned my transmission. But that's it. No sauce. Attention. Okay, that M3 that we were shooting at is now... No, okay, it was a different guy. Okay, we got 50 cows right there. We I don't think we have to worry about him too much. Oh, never mind. The M3 did die. There's another Sherman over here. Ooh. Unfortunate. The cap did not want to get into that turret. Come on. Come on. Come on, Tony. You got to block those rounds. Okay, good first game. We'll just take um, the opposite. We're going to take more AP than the heat. We'll, we'll use heat only for uh, KV-2s and stuff at medium, close, medium, far range. Ah, what is with Port Novo tonight? Hands down the worst design map in the game, but, you know, screw it. Let's keep it in rotation in 2019.
Oh, that sounded scary. That sounded like American 75. Another one. He didn't see me there because of my low silhouette. This is a great place to shoot into Charlie. Example one. That was a great explosion. Wish the lamp wasn't there. The light pole. Nice and efficient killing. Nothing. Oh, thank you. Saved my life, almost, potentially. I wasn't done reloading when that Sherman was on the move out. Oh, wow. Okay, there's someone right here. And I hear people in this pathway to our right. I don't think I'm going to get flanked from the rear just because we have enemies looking into Charlie. Your friendly's looking at... Oh, my. That was artillery. Dang it. I was like, there's no way a tank's over there. Luckily, our gun's still open or operational. I'm having trouble with words tonight. I do apologize. Dang it. I wish that we could get that guy. If we can get this guy. I don't want to risk it right now. shot I don't even uh, honestly I didn't even see that guy okay same plan as last we got to kill might be one guy down here kv2 loading up the heat or excuse me kv1 Good, maybe a little low. Uh-oh. Dang it, smoke's out too. Okay, we'll move on. <laughs> what is this game? What is this? The lightest tanks don't take any damage. 105 millimeter. To the sprocket! Damn it. Oh, he's just killing all of our, our whole team. Oh, lucky me. Lucky, lucky me. I knew someone else was in here. What? I just... Oh, I hate when that happens. I'm not a smart man. Welcome to uh, Urban Combat. I just... I just can't sit back for too long. I have to get in the mix of it. I have to see the person in third person. Let's do it again. That worked out. Freaking tanks with turrets. That's cheating. Hands down, cheating. Thank you. Uh, we got a vehicle over here. Or it's a tank. Watch it be like a scenery Studebaker. Or VW. It is. Look at that. Oh my gosh. He killed everybody. Um. Just gonna disengage here. Oh, I hear someone to my left. Maybe that was the plane. I don't know. No, I definitely hear him.
They really want Alpha. We can go through wood, right? Nice. And it doesn't even do the thing, but bobber. Yeah, we're a little small tank, aren't we? It's a dead end. It doesn't look like it. Almost a prize. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse me, please. I'm gonna troll for a little bit once they get out of the cap. There's so many. Never mind. I'm gonna go hunt back. You know that T30. Oh, what was that? Turn your bus. We got Shermans to kill. Oh, where do you go? Maybe one to the left, too. No! You horse manure! Oh man, he's so good. Look at that. Every round of applause. I just would have shot him in the butt, man. We would have done it. We could have had the flank of a century. A fun tank for 3.3. Low silhouette does help out. But it's a slow velocity firing tank destroyer. Average. Above average. Above average. Now, I kind of know why the um, people were, were, were fearful of the Italians being at it. But uh, little did they know that this guy was around. Did we lose that? Already. Gosh, we held no caps the whole entire game. Feels bad, man. Feel, hashtag rivet life. Fellas, I hope you have enjoyed. Have a good one. Peace out.